the history of media law in Malaysia dates back to the British colonial period. The earliest laws regulating the media were enacted during this time, including the Printing Presses and Publications Act of 1948. This law required publishers to obtain a license from the government before printing or publishing any material. The law also gave the government broad powers to regulate the content of publications and to impose fines or other penalties on publishers who violated the law. After Malaysia gained independence in 1957, the government continued to enact laws regulating the media. In 1963, the Sedition Act was enacted, which criminalized speech that was deemed seditious or likely to incite racial or religious tensions. The law has been criticized for its broad scope and its potential for abuse particularly in cases where it has been used to silence critics of the government. In the 1970s and 1980s, the government continued to enact laws regulating the media, including the Printing Presses and Publications Act of 1984. Here is a summary of some of the key media laws in Malaysia. 1948, Printing Presses and Publications Ordinance. This law required publishers to obtain a license from the government before printing or publishing any material. It also gave the government broad powers to regulate the content of publications. 1957, Malaysia gained independence from Britain. 1963, Sedition Act. This law criminalized speech that was deemed seditious or likely to incite racial or religious tensions. 1972, Official Secrets Act. This law criminalized the unauthorized disclosure of official information. 1984, Printing Presses and Publications Act. This law required publishers to obtain an annual license from the government, and gave the government broad powers to regulate the content of publications. 1998, Communications and Multimedia Act. This law regulates broadcasting and telecommunications services, as well as the multimedia industry. It also provides for the establishment of the Malaysian Communications and Multimedia Commission as the regulatory body responsible for enforcing the law. Film Censorship Act 2002. Oh, the Film Censorship Act governs the censorship of films and movies in Malaysia. Oh, it establishes the Film Censorship Board, which reviews and rates films for public exhibition. 2012. Peaceful Assembly Act. This law regulates public assemblies and requires organizers to obtain a permit from the police before holding a public gathering. 2015. Prevention of Terrorism Act. This law allows for detention without trial and has been criticized for its potential for abuse. 2018, Anti-Fake News Act. This law criminalized the dissemination of fake news and has been criticized for its potential impact on free speech and press freedom. Malaysian Media Council. In October 2019, the Malaysian Media Council was established as a voluntary self-regulatory body for the media industry in Malaysia. The MMC aims to promote media ethics, professionalism, and the rights of journalists. Independent Police Complaints and Misconduct Commission. The IPCMC was proposed as an independent body to address complaints and misconduct involving the Royal Malaysia Police. While not directly a media law, the establishment of the IPCMC is significant for press freedom, as it could improve the relationship between the police and the media when covering law enforcement activities. The proposal for the IPCMC was under consideration as of my knowledge cut-off in September 2021, and it may have undergone further development since then.